Hey everybody, we're in a pretty cool spot here. Uh, we're in a narrow ravine just outside of Jerusalem, and this is where the Emmaus Road came through. And so the story of how Jesus met two disciples there on the road to Emmaus happened right in this ravine. And what you see here are the remains of the old Roman road. There's not much of it left. In fact, uh, a lot of it's already been destroyed with, with modern construction and unfortunately neglect as well. But it's very cool to sit here and read the story and imagine it happening. Uh, we are fairly close, we think, to at least one of the potential sites for Emmaus. And so let me read a couple of these verses. This is Luke 24. Now that same day, two of them were going to a village called Emmaus, about seven miles from Jerusalem. And they were talking with each other about everything that had happened. As they talked and discussed these things with each other, Jesus himself came up and walked along with them, but they were kept from recognizing him, somewhere along this stretch. And he asked, what are you discussing together as you walk along? They stood still, their faces downcast, and one of them named Cleopas asked him, are you the only one visiting Jerusalem who does not know the things that have happened there in these days? And of course the story goes on longer than that, but uh, a little bit later it says, as they approached the village to which they were going, Jesus continued on as if he were going farther, but they urged him strongly, stay with us for it is nearly evening. The day is almost over, so he went in to stay with them. And when he was at the table with them, he took bread, gave thanks, broke it, and began to give it to them, and then their eyes were open. And we're told a few verses later they were so excited that they returned to Jerusalem the same day, uh, even though it was late in the day. So they would have come right back up this road uh, to Jerusalem. It's a very quiet place. Hardly anybody comes here. Uh, pretty neat to be able to see this. So we're going to show you the rest of the valley here, this ravine as it goes on down towards where Emmaus would have been located.